Alright guys, how's it going? How's it going? I hope you all doing alright. Welcome back to the channel. And yes, today is just a quick short vlog day for you all. Three and a half weeks out from the Arnold Classic and this week is uh yeah man. Things have definitely stepped up this week and uh yeah, it's not uh it's been one of the hardest weeks this prep, I gotta say, man. It's definitely has been one of the hardest week we've gone through. If not the by far the hardest week we've been through this prep. Uh, not just from the tired and fatigue part of a lack of calories, but also just, you know, it really kicked in this prep, you know. It's definitely been more of a struggle the last few days. But, you know, it is what it is, you know. Like I've said, like, it's been a great prep so far. And to only be, in, only be three and a half weeks out and only start feeling that difficult part of the prep now, it's, you can't, you can't complain about that. It's been absolutely great. So we're really happy with the progress and where we are at you know, so far right now and how the body's responding. In terms of, you know, physically how we're responding, everything is going spot on, everything's sublime. Everything is moving really smoothly. Um, it's been absolutely, mentally it's been absolutely great until this last two days where it just feels like, you know, the fatigue kicked in, the tiredness kicked in, the lack of sleep kicked in, and you all just seem to kick the gates, the floodgates opened at once and everything, difficult that makes prep difficult just came in at three and a half three weeks out or four weeks out and uh yeah it's definitely kicking my ass a bit but you know with that said i'm still happy with what the process has been um training shoulders today i uh, woke up right now we're on 45 minutes cardio in the morning uh calories all time low three eggs for breakfast and coffee um sweet potatoes for second meal sweet potatoes and steak for second meal um, 200 grams of steak I think you got 200 grams of sweet potato, 250, 250 grams of sweet potato for second meal. Uh, third meal, we have um, rice and mince. So a cup of rice, 180 grams of lean mince for second meal. I'm um, for third meal, that's um, pre-gym meal. And then we kind of go from there, post-gym meal, cup of rice, uh, 250 grams of chicken breast. And then last meal of the night, which we have at nine o'clock, 9 p.m., which is a cup of rice and 250 grams of chicken breast. And then what that allows me to do is, because my last meal is at 9 o'clock and I don't have breakfast till 9 a.m. in the morning, it's a full-on 12-hour fast through the night. We wake up first thing in the morning, I get my cardio done, and then we go through my posing for about half an hour straight after that. So that takes a toll on you, you know, after you've been up, you know, you're starving all through the night and then you wake up, first thing you do is up, it's a 45 minutes cardio, and then you go into straight up, 30 minutes of straight up posing before you actually can have breakfast in. So it tends to take a toll on you and it definitely, you know, hits you quite hard. But that's where we are for this day, trying to get those fine details and make those fine details count. And uh, mentally, all I'm at, where am I mentally? All I'm just thinking is, uh, man, I just wanna, um, I wanna get this prep done, man. I just wanna get this prep done because it's the last one, you know, like we've been prepping since summer last year. And now we're the last few weeks of it, and I just want to get it done so I can finally have a break, have a holiday, have a have some vacation, you know, go ahead and enjoy some downtime, enjoy some good food, rest, and relax, and just take things easy. I know we straight after the Arnold, we're going to do a lot of traveling straight this year. We already got a few trips booked. So the Detroit Pro, I'm going to be at Detroit Show, Pittsburgh. We're going to be guest posing in Pittsburgh. We're going to be guest posing at Germany. Um, quite a few more visits all through the year we already got planned in so I'll be popping them dates on my Instagram as well so you guys can see that 
But yeah, we have a big year coming ahead for all of us this year. The first half of this year is completely gridlocked in bookings. But either way, I want to make sure that I just want to get the prep done out of the way first and have a break and have a relaxing time, spend some time with my family. And, you know, me and Mel, we're sort of planning on a holiday for the first time in years this year. And I mean, I mean a holiday, I mean not a traveling trip to go gym openings or a seminar, but an actual holiday where we're going to have four days of just going somewhere nice. We're looking at different places. We looked at Greece, Turkey, um, Spain, somewhere where we can just have like a nice four days of doing absolutely nothing. Just in a resort, chilled out, relaxed, and just have a real proper downtime because we haven't had that in a very, very, very long time. So that'll be a nice way to sort of close off my season anyway. So that's what I'm, honestly, I'm looking forward to that the most. And that is sort of giving me strength to keep going and keep digging in because I know that we're getting close to that point and we just have to get through this. But, you know, going to the show, definitely feeling confident, definitely feeling good about where we're at in that stead. But in my mindset, I'm just like, you know what? This is something we've done so many times recently. We've done show to show to show. And now I'm just kind of just going through the process and I'm letting Mel and Milo sort of dictate what we're doing you know, in terms of prepping and getting ready for the show. And I just, you know, get through every stream session one at a time, you know, head down, work like a soldier and uh, make the process and make the results happen. So that is where we're at right now with that. Wednesday today, we're going through the process today again, one more day. And uh, one week at a time, one day at a time, one work at a time, just keep pushing through until we get there. So yeah, this is where things are at. And yeah, as difficult as it is, this is what bodybuilding is about at this level. It's all about pushing, even when you're exhausted and you're tired and you don't want to, you just, everything about you is just telling you, man, have a break and just take it easy. But you still hold off and say, nah, we have, we're not done. You don't finish until you're done. So yeah, so this is definitely where we are at with this one. But with that said, guys, uh, yeah, man, let's get through our day. About to have my next meal in a minute and then we're going to get ready to head off for the gym and get our shoulder workout done today. But yeah. Let's get it. <laughs> Welcome to Sunnyside. Good time, Good time. Good time. This character fall barn conversion is set in a lovely large plot. Oh, 
So we back from the gym, uh, back from our shoulder workout, and yep, my ass is tired. I'm, I'm, I'm hanging. Got my post gym meal here: rice, veggies, two fifty grams of chicken. I'm gonna eat that, get changed, and get ready to chill out for the evening. And ex just exhausted. And yeah, and that'll be me for. Then I got one more meal after this at nine o'clock, and that'll be my last meal for the day. And then we start it all over again tomorrow. Yeah, consistently repetitive is progress. That's how it works. But it doesn't have to be exciting. It doesn't have to be uh, fun. You just have to be disciplined, disciplined, and uh, repetitive with it, day in, day out. So. That's what we gotta do. I want a cheeseburger. <laughs> I also want a cheeseburger. <laughs> I want a cheeseburger. <laughs> Remember, when we pre you're prepping, we are prepping. Mm -hmm. I want a cheeseburger. <laughs> the only thing that I can eat in front of you is like some mm -hmm. salads. No. Don't salmon. Worry. A few more weeks only. <laughs> Just a few more weeks and we'll be done. A few more weeks and I'm binging. For sure been too long since the summer been way too long well you know we got it come Rao. any regrets I chose this path myself and I regret nothing all right guys so I haven't my last meal for the night before we go to bed. And yes, last one, a cup of rice, vegetables, and 250 grams of chicken breast. And yeah, one day done, last meal in, and then tomorrow we start again. So this is where we are at. So guys, don't get this dummy and I'll head off to sleep. But for now, guys, thanks for watching and Yes, we'll catch you in the next one, man. Till then, see you next week.